no again. <clears throat> Here, let me turn that down. So today we're going on a, another little bit of a rant. <clears throat> again, really doesn't have anything to do with autism at all, really. Uh, this is more to do with just kind of a few general brands. So, um, let's, without further ado, go ahead and get to it. Um, I'll start with, woo, we talk rules. Sorry. That's a little homage to my brother. He used to bust into my door, nothing but his freaking boxers, and scream Metallica rules at the top of his rungs, and then run out giggling. Um, but anyways, okay, so what's this about today? Just a few things. Uh, now that I've already opened the door on the JDAH thing, I just want to do a quick rant real quick. Um, I'm real sorry about this e-hacker, but... Um, anything that really doesn't have to do with the case, uh, unless it's a movie I'm actually going to be looking into seeing, I don't care. I don't care that A.H. was wearing a Van Halen shirt right after Eddie Van Halen died. Rest in peace, Eddie, by the way. Huge loss. My mom used to play those Van Halen records when I was a little girl. Um, right along with Death Leopard and all of that. But that being said, I don't care what she does in her day-to-day -day life. What she does, publicity stunt or not, in no way affects my life in any way, shape, or form. I, I could not care less what that girl is wearing. So if we could just keep this just to the facts and if we could keep the videos about upcoming movies or whatever, uh, that would be deeply appreciated. I have to see enough of her on my feed and that is already mind numbing already. I don't want to have to see any more of her in my feed than I absolutely freaking have to. She kind of makes me want to scratch my eyes out and hand them to my cat. <laughs> okay, uh, that being said, and um, this is no offense to JD or JK Rowling, I do like the Fantastic Beast series, but my god people, can we stop with the sequels to everything already? Uh, it's been a bitch of mine for a while now. We're talking all the way back into the days of the Star Wars prequels. The original three movies had a, a well-rounded story. Beginning, middle, end. I did not need the prequels. I did not need three more movies after that. There is plenty of material to start with a brand new story with brand new characters in that universe and in other universes as well. Do we really need all of these sequels? And don't even get me started about the remakes. Oh my, does nobody have, does nobody have an original idea anymore? What is with all the freaking sequels and with all the remakes? Come on. It cannot be that hard to come up with a, something new, something fresh, an actual, original idea. Why do we have to keep remaking everything? I want just one writer and director, just one, just one, to come up with something completely original, new, and fresh, okay? Not another book made into a movie, not another remake, just something brand new. Can that be a thing? Can that be a thing, please? I know my voice don't count much for Hollywood, but us nerds out there, we've kind of been done to death with all of this. Give us something new, okay? Please just 
give us something. Kind of had to go ahead and get that out there. Alright, now, uh, just a few other things I kind of wanted to get off my chest here. Um, so, uh, obviously quarantine bored to death and I'm a nerd. So, of course, I'm going to get into these arguments on YouTube about villain versus villain, what have you. Right, the two biggest ones have been Voldemort versus Gandalf and Dumbledore versus Gandalf. I'm going to go ahead and sell this for you right now. If you are an uber token nerd, you know that both Sauron and Gandalf are demigods. They're celestials. They're about <coughs> the uh, Christian equivalent of archangels, okay? So, there is literally no spell, no nothing that anybody from the Harry Potter verse could throw at Gandalf, Saruman, the Blue Wizards, Sauron, literally nothing they could throw <coughs> that would actually hurt them really in any way, shape, or form. They, you cannot pit a celestial against a human being. The most powerful human being is no more threat to a celestial than the most powerful cockroach. Alright? You can argue spells all that you want to. But the fact of the matter is, Gandalf, at full power, an all out and out, everybody's full power battle, Gandalf would destroy them. We're talking about a being that has the power to create. To create. Not recreate. Actually create. Alright? He, he, you're not going to win. You're not going to win, okay? He took on a full-blown freaking demon. A demon. Okay? I'm sorry, but I cannot see Dumbledore, no matter how powerful he is, take on a Belrog and live. He would shoot a killing curse, or any of the dark wizards in Harry Potter shoot any killing curse, and anyone, the Belrog, Saruman, Gandalf, would look at him, blink, and say, ooh, that tickled. Alright? The only beings that can actually affect them are beings of their same caliber. So, Nerd rant over. I win. Go cry now, okay? You just go cry because your favorites cannot beat Ganda. Alright? Sorry. Please take your tears elsewhere. Alright. Back to this GDAH thing. Can we not put the spam in the clickbait? I know right now you're just trying to fill the space until the verdict actually comes out, but I don't need to know what they had for breakfast this morning. I don't really care. And oh my god, her lawyers. Maybe it's my autism, but I... Less is more, okay? You don't need to be throwing a whole new queen at 4GD every time the man turns around. Is this girl kidding me right now? Does she have no wife? Does she have nothing else better to do than create more claims? Are you freaking kidding me? I don't know if she legitimately believes in these claims, if they're just a stall tactic of some sort, but my god, girl, get a hobby, find something to do. I uh, know, just stop. I mean, it's just making you look more and more unhinged to the world every single day. At, at 
this point, just let it go. Find something to do and just wait for the verdict like everyone else. Alright, so those are my rants. I will probably have an autism video out later. I might not. You all have a good one.